Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm just Tia and today I have some updates for you guys because I have been working quite a bit off camera um, in between episodes just to, you know, decorate and make the area look a bit better um, around the main area and stuff. So let me show you. So on the map you can see there's there's some greenery around this main area, around our house and everything, and the farms, and around where the barn is, and everything. Um, also, I um, changed up the villager hut over here, for changed up the entrances to the villager hut, but let me show you around here. So we added some cobblestone, I mean, some andesite and some mossy cobblestone around on the paths to just, you know, give it some texture. Um, and I added these like stone mole mounds to, you know, um, I don't know, give it some dimension, some depth. <laughs> and these little stone buttons as pebbles um, to give the illusion that there's pebbles around. So yeah, I just used some, uh, and some glow berries around some of the buildings um, just to give some more light around the area. Um, but yeah, I put it all like there's... I put all of this andesite and cobblestone all the way around the paths and we added some new lampposts and everything. Um, you can go away. But yeah, we I, I added a whole bunch of lampposts and stuff and more just like details to make the area look a lot better around here so it's not so flat and it's got some at least some dimension, you know? All the way around here from the back of the house and just around to our farms um and if we go across the bridge i bone mealed also this side some of this side um and added some new lamp posts as well um just also to give some light and texture um I haven't done this part of the thing because i want to add like different things into it I want to add um, like little things to fill up space around the area um, and yeah I so I changed the entrance from to the building from here to this little fence here um, on the side of the building because the villagers were kept getting killed so if we go in here there's two entrances um, to go from one side to the other but yeah, if we go in here, there's all our villages, the cleric, the Fletcher. Um, I put all my previous villages in order so that all of the same villages are together. Um, so like the, the, what are you? Um, the mason. <laughs> so that the stone masons are together and all of the librarians are together in the same place. So I don't have to look for them when I want to get certain trades. Um, but also if we go down here to the underground so if we come down here um, there are more villages down here because they didn't want to come up with me so you know we just had to make do with what we had um, but anyways we have a shepherd a fisherman a um, armorer a cartographer a butcher a toolsmith another farmer and a leather worker um, you know, I just wanted to get all of the trades that you could get from villages. And um, on this side, I want to replicate the same thing, but I need a villager trader. I mean, a villager breeder. So I need to get working on that. <laughs> so we can fill this whole area up. But yeah, um, that's mostly all of the updates. So now, let's get to the actual plan of the video.
have dogs. I have two dogs now. I'm so excited. <laughs> Where's the other one? Um, oh, there, there he is. Bobby dog, you need to sit. So, so they're just gonna stay there. Um, you guys should help me name them because if you don't, I might probably forget about them. So, comment down names for the dogs. Anyways, back on our quest, we're gonna go, go to the Nether to try and get some netherite or ancient debris so that you can make some full netherite armor um, so I just got to get all my tools and stuff that I need in order to get the you know in order to survive the nether and come out victorious in our expeditions so I will just I'm gonna grab the equipment I need and I'll meet you guys in the we are here we are queer. No shame. Um, okay, so we are here in the nether. We just made it. Um, there's a cat somewhere. I have no idea how or when or why a cat got into the nether. But I hope for the best. I can just hear it. I can't see it. But we are going to go. I'm going to do a little bit of research quickly to find out which... What level we need to be on. We are currently on level 54. Y level. So we we need to be on level a 22 to 8 says Google. So we are just going to try and dig down all the way and see if we can find some ancient debris. So let's see what happens. Um oh, I can already see a whole pool of lava. I do not think this is a good idea to do to dig down here. Oh look, there's a strider. Um, hmm. Maybe I can go down there to get to the lower level. So I'm going to try bri bridge across and see what we can find. On second thought, I don't think that's a good idea to go across there. So I'm just gonna, let's go back up and see if we can go in a different direction. Oh, there's a ghost. Let's see if I can get, kill a ghost. Kill the ghost. Oh, I'm a bit stuck, my game's a bit laggy. Let's go, let's go. Let's go ghost friend. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no. I forgot they shoot fireballs. Oh, did we do it? Did we get a ghast here? We did! We got a ghast here! Look at us being so good at this game. Freaking pro gamer, man. Okay, so um, I'm gonna go and try and find a place to dig down. And I will catch up with you guys in a moment. Oh my god, no. <clears throat> so I'm currently swimming in lava. Um, welcome back. <laughs> As I hit record, I was about to fall. Um, but let's, we, how, I hope, I hope I'm not going to die. Let's, oh, let's try to get there. Try to get to that thing before I die. If I survive this, it will actually be a miracle if I survive this whole thing. Come on, two and a half hearts. Two hearts, two and a half hearts. Oh no, I'm going to die. I'm so close. I'm so close. Oh my God. Well, that was an experience. Well, that happened. Um, good thing I have keep inventory on. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have lost all of my belongings. Um, okay, let's try that again. Because I'm not going to give up this time. So, I will see you guys in a second when I have at least one piece of ancient debris. So we found a nether fortress. Um, 
Also, welcome back. It's been about an hour or so, and I found a nether fortress. Um, my inventory is so full right now. But I'm going to take all of these things from here, and we're going to go explore the nether fortress, see what we come across. Diamonds? What? Two diamonds, that's crazy. And some nether wart. I hear blazers. Where are they? Kind of scared, but I want to know where they are. Oh, there they are. I can see them. Ooh, this that's kind of scary. But I do want to I want to try shoot them. I'll try fight them. There's a wither skeleton! so scary. I've never had to fight so many blazers before. Hey, but at least I get blaze rods, right? <laughs> and XP. Oh, I should build an XP farm around. Oh, hello. I should build an XP farm around this thing. Make a blaze spawner into an XP farm. Wow, and there was a wither skeleton. Two wither skeletons. It was crazy. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna go explore some more.
finally found it! My first piece of ancient debris. Please say it doesn't just give me one. Oh, damn, my inventory's a bit full. Um, I'll drop the bucket of water. But we finally found our first piece of ancient degree. Ancient debris. <laughs> that is incredible. Um, I've been mining for about an hour, an hour and a half um, after I fought those blazes, but we found it. We f I finally found a piece, but I'll be back when, when I find more. So after one of the most treacherous adventures I have ever had, the longest adventure I have ever, ever done in this game, we finally have the enough pieces to make a full set of armor. So we have 36 pieces. Now I just need to figure out how to actually turn the ancient debris into nether wart. I mean, not nether wart, um, netherite scraps. Um, so I'm gonna do a little quick Google and figure it out. And then, yeah, I'll show you guys when I have the full set of armor. Well, there you guys go. Here it is. We've got full sets of netherite armor and a full set of netherite tools as well. So we are all kitted out in netherite. We look so cool. Um, I feel so powerful. I feel like I could take on the world. I could take over the world. Um, I had to borrow my village's um, smithing table though. But yeah, we... Um, we did it and we have one netherite ingot left. But yeah, um, that's it for the video guys. Um, hopefully next, next episode we can go to the end and, you know, finish the game and then focus on the overworld stuff. But yeah, um, thank you for watching guys. Sorry the video is so long. Um, there was a lot that, there was a lot of nether. But yeah, um, that's it for the video, guys. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Um, comment down below names of dogs. Name the dogs' names. And I'll name them in the next episode. Um, but yeah, I'm so like proud of myself. So pleased with myself that I actually was able to do this. But yeah, um, I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next video.